I'm the Bobby Pin Queen Pin. Nile is my favorite. I swear by it. Listen, these babies are fluttering. You hear me? I'm going to do a quick little glam, little, I gotta do my hair. <sighs> I'm gonna do a pin curl and a soft glam, just kind of how I get ready for my day. I'm gonna start with this blow dried hair, <laughs> of course. Fully make sure it's dry. Honestly, I washed and blow dried this yesterday. I added a little bit of zhuzh today so I can do this video for you guys. I am obsessed with pin curls. So that is what we're going to do. Start low and then I go high. And so that is what we are going to do today. Again, I make sure everything is combed out, dry. I can brush through. My hair is naturally very curly and it sweats out a lot. So, and basically what you do, this is Fabulous Pro. Prima 3100. So this honestly is one of my favorites. Um, and honestly, you just take each section of your hair. Pretty much everybody knows how to kind of straighten, but I recommend titanium plates. They are really good on your hair. And look at this curl, look at this curl. It is the curl for me, honey. It's the curl for me. So just make sure you're careful, but I basically start like this and I take them in sections and then I continue to curl. Sometimes I dread doing my hair, I'm not gonna lie, but I really always love the finished product, especially when I just want like a simple, cute, everyday look. Um, and this style will honestly last me, I don't know, let's say like a week. So now this whole little row is done. And guess what? These are my best friends. These are my best friends. I am the Bobby Pin Queen. I ain't a king pin, I'm a queen pin. The Bobby Pin Queen Pin. That's a tongue tester for y'all. But anyways, then you just kind of roll up with your hand, try to get the curls to all match. And then you do like this circle round motion here, rolling it into a pin, rolling it into a wheel, circle. You take the bobby pin, clamp it down. It's on there, not sure if you guys can see. And then I'm going to do the same with the other side, get those curls aligned. And so I do one whole row originally, and then I, um, I put some of them together so uh, it holds better. I don't bobby pin each individual like section that I straightened. I only do that so I, each section does get straight. But yeah, so now look, boom, and you see I got a ton of hair like a ton of hair the other section is already pinned now let's get to work <laughs> For the parting section of the hair that actually matters, it's this little crown thing here. As you see, a full crown. If you want a part full in the middle, side, side. I am a side part girl. Let's 
pretty about straight. <laughs> but I like side parts, so with that being said, I do part that, so then the curls, once I get to the very top top, they'll know which way to go, and they're not all over the place. Pinch and twirl. Remember the snap and bend, but it's a push, a pinch, and a twirl. Just like that, one side is complete. Yes, I leave the baby hairs out. And to be transparent, I have excessive baby hairs right now. Like I had mentioned, I have a new baby. So, Lola Gianna is her name, hey girl. But she pulled my hair out absolutely so i definitely um my hair grew so much while i was pregnant but <laughs> also we basically lost hair at the same time around when she was like four months and then you know four months postpartum you know my hair just started to come out and i was like oh no honey then snatched my edges <laughs> it was a hot mess but they grew back like immediately so thank god for that literally <laughs> prayed and thanked him because i thought they was gone honey i thought i was gonna have no edges no more but i do thankfully um so yeah so i have excessive baby hairs due to that to find some more bobby pins Hold on. and i'm back listen i told you i'm the bobby pin queen pin i got bobby pins all over what 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 millie rock who you know millie rock with a flat iron nobody because she ain't supposed to because they're hot and again just like that i'm finished if you want to get an aerial view, an up close and personal, if you can really see, I'll probably go over the little baby hairs again. And I leave it like that. We're gonna come back and then you're going to see the glam. Up next, just like that, we're back. So we're going to glam this face up. Just a soft glam though. Put something under my eyes. I normally do it like a triangle and then I use concealer to cover up any other blemishes you take a sponge a fingertip or whatever I'm gonna use my finger for this purpose just because I have I don't have too much on I'm just going to put on some BB cream my color is 130 a deep medium and I'm doing all this while we wait for the pin drops I mean <laughs> I'm doing all this while I wait for the pin curls to drop, honey. Next, we are going to use, if you can see it, a Ruby Kisses Matte Powder Foundation. Golden Honey is my color shade, so let's go ahead and use this. And I love a matte powder foundation. It just sets everything in. I told y'all this is going to be a quick soft glam. This is an everyday look for me. I, I go over my face a few times just to make sure it's fully even. It's Huda Beauty as a setting powder. And ma'am, this is Goldie, I believe. Blondie, Blondie. Ma'am, just apply underneath. Just a nice translucent powder to really bring out and highlight um, your under eyes. Just going to do this. Mm. 
And I'm just going to let that set for a second. Next, I'm going to do my eyebrow. Top brow, New York Kiss. But I like it because it has the dual action. Just to connect and make it fuller. Ruby Kissens. Boop, 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 boop. I'm going to use this one right here. It's darker. I'll mix the two. Round on your cheeks. I always smile when I do it. Like I said, I was only going to let that set for a few minutes, the um, highlighting powder, the translucent powder. So just did a quick couple things. Now I'm going to put it off. But the, and you just take a brush and you wipe it off. Next, of course, the lashes. I'm going to be using my girl's Lash Line Lash A10. Yes, and this is the Nile Boom inside. Is that not gorgeous? Oh, shine. Check me out, check me out. Again, look how lovely these look on fluttering. Again, Lash A10, check them out. I believe it's lashaten.com. Go ahead and copy one. The Nile is my favorite. I swear by it. All right. And now for the lip, I'm just using an EOS moisturizer. Yes, LA Girl Nude is what I'm going to be using next. Just to complete the look. It's very subtle. So, for a closer up and a close up view of my glams beat look finally the big reveal show what the beauty curls will look like so much this is my favorite edge control acai you say oh my gosh smells so good on top of holding your hair so that's always my thing that I love when somebody's like wow you smell great and it's normally my hair <laughs> and just go and there you have it. That is how you pin curl your hair. An everyday look that will just have you looking like a movie star. Listen, these babies are fluttering. You hear me? Please like, subscribe, follow, do everything you need to do right down here below. I will love you for it forever. You won't be sad that you did. <laughs> so stay tuned and let's get into it because we all need to look like movie stars because you are one too.